Hello everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel, Jesse Rhodes. I just wanted to wish everybody a happy new year, and uh, I know it's been a very interesting year to say the least, especially for all the changes that all of us have been witnessing in the world when it comes to uh, movie titles, when it comes to uh, certain lines in movies that we all remember being a certain way, and just a little bit of everything that's changed because of the Mandela effect. And I haven't been on doing any talk about the Mandela Effect for a while because I decided to take a little bit of a break just to kind of focus on my life and try to get things together for a while. However, I am going to be coming back with some more works and bringing up some more um, facts and more things that I learn, more things that I see. I will now be sharing again on YouTube. I know I've been silent for a while, so I just wanted to kind of let everybody know that's the reason why, was just because I wanted to kind of get things together in my life and, and focus more on that right now. So there has definitely been a lot of new Mandela effects I've learned about um, or have heard about as well, and that is apparently now we have Blackford squirrels. Now, I got that from somebody else on YouTube. I really didn't get much of a chance to do much research into that. But I definitely want to do some more research into that um, because I've never known that we've had Blackford squirrels. And educationally speaking, it's possible that they've always been out there and that we've just now discovered them. But we have to remember that with the Mandela effect, apparently, um, once a new one is brought up or is recognized, later through research you find out that they've always existed in that they didn't just all of a sudden get discovered a week ago. They've always been there. So that's always the surprise with the Mandela effects that all of us out there have been getting since we've been finding these or um, locating these. So it's, it's definitely um, interesting, but I'll do a little more research into that. I know there's several others that, have, that I've become aware of now that are very strange, but I'll go into more details about those later, talk about those later. So I hope everybody had a really good year. Um, I definitely had a, a lot of success this year in getting things together and, and uh, mostly just getting through the year um, with sanity, especially after recognizing everything that has changed um, within my own timeline. And I'm just so glad to know that I'm not the only one that's recognizing all this stuff that's just so different. It definitely is just so different, and uh, people in general are definitely different than what I remember. As, as I've discussed before about the Mandela Effect, an old friend of mine, as I've said in one of my previous videos, used to be a completely different person. He used to be strong-willed, responsible, um, took care of himself, you know, was a good guy, and then all of a sudden it's like once I start recognizing these Mandela effects and I start, you know, rekindling that friendship again with him over the last couple of years, I began to notice that he was just not the same. He was not responsible. He was not strong willed. He didn't have as much of a strong character. He didn't really want to take care of himself. He was always trying to and still is until this day, trying to take advantage of people. And it the funniest part about it is is that he remembers everything the way that it is now, that us who have been affected by this remember it differently. He remembers Fruit Loops being, you know, F R O O T instead of F R U I T. He remembers um, Magic Mirror on the wall. He remembers No, I Am Your Father. He remembers all the basics differently. And he's also just such a different person. I mean, it's it's been very astonishing to me to learn about this guy that he was just so different before. And it's like it's it's like for me, that is a sign that timelines have merged, that this is a different version of that person that was my friend in my reality in my previous one, but is now just completely a different person. So it's my own witnessing of my own life. Now, not much has changed in my own life that is really that different. 
Um, everything's pretty much normal for me. But recognizing that friend and just how different he is really kind of helped me to see what direction we're going in. Um, it's just, there's been bi biblical changes, words and scripture in the Bible have been changed. Um, logo is not the same anymore. Everything's spelled different. It's, it is a headache. And a lot of people that are out there think that, you know, I'm insane and because I, that I see this stuff. But it definitely is stuff that I see, you know, and I can't deny it. And I, I really don't would rather not deny it. So to all my subscribers out there, I know I've been quiet, but I'm glad to be back. And I definitely want to say there's more videos coming for the Mandela Effect. Um, I'm going to keep trying to get my findings and even if it's in movies or like I was doing before, try to bring them back as much as I can. Um, I know it takes a lot to grow support for what's going on, but I'm doing my very best to grow this channel and the liking to bring awareness to what's going on. And I am going to be branching this channel out to also talk about paranormal stuff, which I'm really into that. And also to talk about, um, even maybe possibly splitting away into an advice channel or maybe a vlog channel somewhere down in the future to just tell you about my everyday experiences with Mandela effects or, or more um, other than just my main feed videos that I may share. So thank you guys. I hope you have a good 2017 and I'm hoping that I could definitely get time to bring more works to you and some real good ones. So peace. Thank you.